This is James Selder for IFL TV in association with Matchless Jim Marbella. I'm at the phones for your arena today for the um, Frank Warren card, the Fox Nation card. With me, I've got the new British light lightweight champion, Terry Flanagan. What's happening, Tom? Yeah, good, mate. Uh, just won this beautiful belt I made up. I'm over the moon. What more can I say? Absolutely fantastic fight. Gavin's corner retiring him at the end of the seventh round due to uh, injuries sustained during the fight. Can you talk to me a little bit about the fight? Uh, the fight, I thought, I went out with a plan to box and box his head off, but I felt so comfy on the ropes and thought I was landing a cleaner shot, so I was happy to stay there. I thought, if he keeps taking these, I'd take him out in the later rounds, and I took him out earlier than I thought. Seemed like fantastic tactics, sitting on the rope, taking some of the shots, then letting off the he won't, shots. He wasn't putting much in him, if he was putting stuff in him and I was feeling a few, I'd have come off and yeah. got back on my boxing, I but that. I was blocking and coming back whereas he was in between and landing clean, so I thought I'd stay there. And the corner again, get off the ropes, get yeah, off the yeah. ropes, but you know you're not feeling, the not, shots are not hurting you and you're landing your work, aren't and you? I was winning the rounds as well by doing it and it was comfy, yeah. so I was happy to stay there and I knew if he, he won't keep taking them all night, so... I thought I'd take him out in the later rounds. 24 fights, you are now the British champion. 25, that. 25 yeah. fights, correct me. How, how are you feeling? Oh, over the moon. Uh, unbelievable. It's all I've ever wanted, this belt, and now I've got it and made up. Four years ago, fighting at Bantam Weight, eight stone. I'll move up again. Yeah, how did you go from there to now? I'll to move career. up again. I'll fight at, at, at like Walter. Walter Way. I'll, I'll move up the weights. I'm still going. Me, I'm. Um, I won't mature. I put a bit of muscle on. I'll fight anyway. <laughs> the crowd seems to be very receptive to you. You seem to be building a fantastic fan base in Manchester, Terry. You really do. Yeah, not, the fans is unreal. Dead. I've got to thank them as well for coming out. You've seen them at the weigh-in yesterday. It was unreal. Unreal. That's what they that's what they're like from around our way. They're mad. They're off the head. If there's 50 of them, they'd make that much noise. And with 300 of them, it's unreal. I've always. Uh, when I won, when that final, when he pulled, when he retired, and I knew I was getting that belt, and I looked up, it was my best feeling ever. Unreal. Where'd you go from here? Would you be looking to win this belt outright, Terry? Is that something that plays on your mind? Yeah, I'm happy to move on for bigger titles, me. But if the now comes, I'm happy to defend this again. Hopefully, here when Tyson comes back and fights Chisora. Yeah. So, or whatever, I'll move on for a bigger belt. You've seen the fans, there'll be even more next time, so it's nice to uh, hopefully top a bill myself. Will you be looking at the likes of Derry Matthews, Steve Ormond, these kind of guys for, for future opponents? Yeah, anyone. Anyone who's next in line to fight for this British, will fight. Anyone in the country. You've got to love that attitude, don't you? Yeah. You really have. So I, I fight whoever Steve says, and mm. I'm happy to fight anyone. Credit to Steve as well, because he's been with you all the way through it, Steve Woods, all the way through the journey, and he's kept faith in you, hasn't he? He has, yeah. When I went selling tickets on his shows and he's losing money on me, he's stuck by me, and I'm happy to repay him now. And here you are now, yeah. correct me, 25 fights British champion. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> this is what I want. Absolutely yeah. amazing. Have you got Cheers, a message yeah. for all your friends and your family? Just uh, thank you very much for coming out and supporting me, my girlfriend, Chanel, and the baby, for putting up with my moods and stuff food training, like being grumpy and stuff, so yeah, she's got had a lot on the plate, so yeah, go and give her a kiss and the baby and go and celebrate my win with him. Top man. How much respect have you got for Martin Geffen? Because he's a real tough guy, he kept coming and his corner had to save him from himself, in all fairness. Yeah, I've got the, the utmost respect for him. I knew he was a tough kid, I knew he was going to be in a fight tonight. People said, Oh, he's finished, he's lost his last two, but I know Martin comes to a fight as a warrior and he would come to win that fight. He truly believed he was going to win that fight like I did, so he's going to come. Anyone who fights for this British title gives it their all because it's a beautiful belt and it's what people want to win. So, yeah, utmost respect for him as a warrior. Listen, congratulations on winning the Lonsdale straps. It's been a long time coming, mate. Yeah, has been, yeah. And um, enjoy your success. Thank Cheers. you for talking to Thank you. Nice one, mate. Thank you, Terry, mate. Cheers.